Hello and welcome to today's episode of 3D Drawing for your Model Railway. In today's episode we're going to learn how to use the pipe command, the plane at an angle and the horizontal and vertical constraint commands. So to learn these new commands and tools what we're going to do is create a down pipe um, that would come down the side of the building to, for water coming off the roof. We're also going to create a pipe at an angle as if there was a sink inside and it's being used as a drain that flows into this down pipe. So the first thing I'm going to do is create an offset plane. I'm going to spin this around. I'm going to offset. I'm going to offset from this face here. Drag that in. Six mils, fine. Okay, and then we're going to create a new sketch on that plane. So we're going to use the lines tool, and we're going to draw a line down from the top, coming down and then a line that comes out at a bit of an angle. So we're going to define those lines. So we're going to select that point to that edge and we're going to say that's going to be 0.2 millimeters and then we're going to angle from that line to that line at 133 degrees I would define the length of that line as 1.1 millimeters. Okay, we're then going to use the horizontal and vertical constraint to constrain that core, that the, that end of the line, to the top edge of our wall. So these two will always stay in the same position height-wise. Okay, see the last thing we've got to define. Is this angle here so what it's trying to work out is how far it is from that point to the bottom edge okay so we're going to go back into sketch dimensions and we're going to change this height at the moment it's 1.28 I'm going to change it to 1.1 uh, okay you see that's pulled that down it's pulled the whole line down but you'll see because we constrained the top edge here these will stay the same height okay Okay, so we're now going to finish the sketch. So the line is, and the sketch is still there, but we're now we're going to turn it into a pipe. So we're going to go create pipe, and then we're going to select the line. And you can see it's automatically picked up at 0.3 millimeters. I'm going to change it to 0.5 millimeters, give it a bit more beef. Okay, so we've now got our down pipe coming down the side of our building. I'm going to add a little bit more detail to it by creating a new sketch on this bottom edge and I'm going to create a center point circle I'm going to select the center point I'm going to change it to 0.3 millimeters okay and then I'm going to extrude that slightly into the pipe so it actually looks like a pipe rather than just a tube coming down there okay so that's our down pipe added. The next thing I said we're going to draw is a pipe that comes down side the building as if there's a, a sink or something inside to drain into the down pipe. So we're going to now create a, a plane at an angle. So it's going to this is going to make a construction plane that we can draw on to find at an angle and we have to pick a line to, to angle off of um, because I want the angle to go angle that direction I'm going to have to pick one of the lines on the side of the bricks here okay so I'm going to pick this line here you can see I've now got the plane and I need to define what angle I've got so I'm going to, you can see the orange line coming across here where the plane is I'm going to create an angle about there so minus 10 degrees so now I've got a plane that runs diagonally across my, my brick wall here. I'm going to click on OK. You see that a little bit better as I rotate that round. So now I'm going to draw a sketch on that plane. Okay. I'm going to go to the top down view. I'm going to use the line tool that we were using previously. I'm going to try and pick a point as, as close to centre as, as there as I can get. I'm going to come out, I'm going to say 2.5 millimetres. And then I'm going to go into the wall. It doesn't matter how far, as long as it actually goes all the way in. 
and then I'm going to define my sketch dimensions from the line. I'm actually going to have to go, won't pick the line, it needs to go from to, needs to go from the point to the wall. I'm going to define that as 0.2 millimeters. Okay, so the last thing we need to define is this line here. So I'm going to sketch define the dimension from that point to that face. I'm happy with that distance there. Okay, and finish sketch. So we've now got that line that we've just drawn. These purple lines are projected positions based on our dimensions here uh, against the wall. Um, you don't really need to worry about them for the moment. So the next thing I'm going to do is create a pipe on that pipe that we've just drawn. And we actually change that down to 0.3 millimeters, so it's a little bit smaller. And make sure it's joining, click on OK. So if we zoom out a little bit and have a look now, we've got our, our brick wall we've drawn with the archway and window frames and our downpipe and the drain pipe going into the side of it. I'm really happy with how this is looking. Um, if you've got any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. Um, if you're happy with the content, you're enjoying what you're seeing, please press the like button and hit subscribe. Thanks for watching.